Yeah. Welcome back to Psychonauts. The, the world where everyone is here. And aim. Dang. Oh, another pre-rendered cutscene. You know it's important then. Alright, we, uh, we've taken out all the sensors. Yeah. What did you guys miss? <laughs> I think this is the only ep or the only level where I have to edit like this. <laughs> it's, but I, usually I can make better transitions, but whatever, we're only five episodes in. Oh well, it can only go downhill from here. No, it's going uphill from here. So, uh, what would happen if you were to say completely block off all your sensor outlets? Well, Hell, what would happen? <laughs> here? It's right behind him. <laughs> oh dear. Meet the first boss of the game. Oh, I don't like that. The Mega Sensor. You are my own creation. I command you to stop. <laughs> oh no. Like three characters try that, it never works. You know, I love the little talking spray like next to the dialog boxes and how they they have like they're all slightly open. Yeah. And it yeah. never changes. <laughs> Alright, so you gotta fight this big old boy. This, um... This is actually a pretty easy fight. Now, you noticed I did some damage... <laughs> I noticed you did some damage. So, I did some damage to him, and then he immediately regained it. What is going on here is, um... I don't think I figured it out yet. I think this boss gives me a little bit of trouble, actually. Good going. So around the arena are more of those like sensor valves. What you need to do is destroy them and then he can't regain his health. And it's as simple as that. Mutant. Yep, there are five on the cube. They gotta get the cube. Yep. That looks really weird when he... Oh, oh I died. The big old boy <laughs> Adam, I'm gonna say your screen is dusty. Yeah, my screen is pretty dusty. The light is hidden through the window because it's finally spring. Almost... <laughs> no, it's almost summer now. Okay, Sasha. This is, yeah, there aren't many bosses in this game, although, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not really a huge fan of the bosses. <laughs> um, I find a lot of them very samey. Then again, when it comes to games with, um, with, um, like, move sets this limited, there's not really much you can do, so I can't really hate them too much. Um, what did you do? <laughs> I don't, I think I hit a tutorial and did that at the exact same time. Why can Raz get off with Sasha not? I don't know. Is it child power? Oh, it must be the um, It's protagonist power. The main, I think he lost me for a second there. The main character shield, plot armor. Plot armor? Yeah. I heard that term today. You've heard plot armor before today? Yeah. It happens. Happens to the best of us. There we go. So now that's done, now you can actually hurt him. What's on his tongues? It looks like he's burning up. I don't- uh, by the way, what does he throw at you? I have no clue. We're gonna say it's, um... What did you say, Aaron? Huh? Oh, by the way, these sensors are smaller, but they're faster. Yeah. They're teeny tiny sensors. At you, he's throwing, um, fair use. He's throwing fair, fair use. use. Excellent. You've shut down the valve. It's like quivering. What is that junk? I'll destroy him. I, that's like the weirdest thing about this boss to me. I have no clue what that's meant to be. That's the weirdest thing about this boss? Yeah. Look where we are right now, Adam. <laughs> oh, they're meatballs. Oh, they're meatballs? No, they're not What's meatballs. the correlation? Um, oh, freaking Who heck. doesn't like meatballs? Use your mental focus, Rasputin. It will help you shoot accurately and also help you with your evasive... <laughs> <laughs> in the middle of the yeah, yeah. There we go. So yeah, that fight isn't too bad. So is this where I get a speech and learn another lesson? No, here's your merit badge. Oh, that's good. Never speak. Thank <laughs> Let's never speak. Well, Rez single-handedly broke Sasha. And there we go. We got our first or our second merit badge and our first power. Marksmanship. Those are those little icons there are all the powers. I want you to guess what some of them are if we see them again. Oh, okay. Yeah, <laughs> it's. Victory for good to Oh, I, I love this line coming up. I want to shoot more things. Okay, okay, enough about my mind. Let's stay out of my mind. <laughs> okay, okay, we're done here. All right, let's go, <laughs> let's go back to into your... Let's go on to next people. Let's or... go back in the tumbler. Although first... Wait. Yes. <laughs> oh, 
my boy. <laughs> it's, that's why I like Sasha. Let's call Cruller. Oh, no. That's what the bacon does. <laughs> yeah, he's in your head. Oh, dear. <laughs> so, I, I, now that we have enough ranks, we can go back to him and get a new power. Uh, thanks. <laughs> thanks. <laughs> Okay, are you just gonna immediately warp back to old man? There I you think go. so, yeah. <laughs> At any point you can warp back here if you ever need to like exchange ranks or anything. We get the pyrokinesis ability. I don't think there are many abilities you get from Crawler himself. Um, most of the other stuff you get for, for ranks are just upgrades to the stuff you already have. Alright, let's see if I can make out any. Uh, the... the... The two eyes, totally those are two eyes. Yeah, um, that's actually one of my favorite abilities. You shall see into their soul? No, yes. I actually sort of, but we'll, we'll we'll talk about that later. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's... Oh, you're back at your gypsy cart? Yeah. Why is Crawler here? Uh, this is like a tutorial on how to use power kinesis. Has to think about it? <laughs> he has to think of something he wants to burn. Deep. I, I like this line coming up too. So all day long he would force me to practice my acrobatics, hoping to distract him, or maybe hoping to kill him. I never was sure. Now why are you still talking when you could Oh, maybe that's a different tutorial. Oh, you, you made us go silent. <laughs> I made us go long. silent. I'm sorry, happy viewers. burn the rest. Come on, I didn't train you in that, so you could say By the way, every NPC in the game <laughs> I, I mentioned this before, there's like four, uh, three or four different types of attacks in the game, and every single NPC has a reaction to being hit with every one of them. It's an amazing attention to detail that I just kind of love. Look at that thing bouncing around the back. <laughs> I love him! Hurry, get him. Hurry! There he is. There we go. Actually, I could have used some of that. So yeah, how pyrokinesis works, it's kind of hard to tell just watching it, but what you need to do is you lock onto something, like you get an outline around it, and then you hold down the button for the power. And that's how you set something on fire. Hmm. Uh, some things will be harder to burn than others, so you have to hold it down longer. Some things cannot be burned at all. I promise. And if you're doing it to impress girls, make sure none of them have on a lot of... <laughs> it's... Oh, hairspray is super flammable. Fucking hairspray. Because that's a good thing to put on something which is already flammable. <laughs> There's a card up there. I can't get that yet, though. It's just gonna torment you until it's, you can. It's pretty obvious we get a higher jump at some point because of stuff like that. A super duper jump. Mm -hmm. Oh, it is a super duper jump. Is the word duper used? No, no. Then what's the point? I don't know. So I, I decided to cut back here. Um, I, I want to buy some stuff now that I have enough, um... A week? <laughs> He's back ordering burgers. So now that I have a lot of arrowheads, I want to go ahead and buy a couple things. Um, most notably, the, um, that thing, the dowsing rod. I think you can buy a set- oh no, you need to be rank 10 to buy it. For some reason, you need to be a certain rank to buy certain items. Um, once you're a certain rank, though, you never need to worry about it. Now, it took quite a while to get 100 arrowheads, um, however, this really helps you get arrowheads fast, although it's kind of tricky to use. Okay, you're yeah. letting us read through all of this stuff. Are you getting yeah. anything else? I think I tried to buy something, but realized I don't have... No, I, I don't have anything for it. Oh, no, I buy some of this. <laughs> it's, uh, you can combine this with the cards in order to uh, make ranks. Basically, just buy as many of these as you can. Oh, this is the dialogue mess. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. I actually do speed this up later. <sighs> Titanium arrowheads. <laughs> okay, adventure. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Oh no, so many people are talking at once. So you can set people on fire. 
Um, um uh, what? <laughs> Wait, game? Run. Oh, <laughs> stop hitting people. You gotta hear the unique, uh, the unique... <laughs> you gotta, um... You promised you wouldn't burn more kids. <laughs> it's... I gotta show off the unique dialogue, Aaron. Let's go. Super unique. Yes. Right. Okay, All what right, are you doing let's, now? Let's, let's crossfade back here. Okay. That's one of the... That was the game kind of glitching out. Okay, so how the dowsing rod works, it's kind of weird. You have this thing on your, on your left, and um, you need to mash the button constantly when you do this. The closer you are, the higher that thing will raise when you mash it. And when you get close enough, uh, you can mash really hard in order to dig up upwards of like 50 arrowheads at once. Huh. Um, this first one takes me a little while. I do cut all of these out eventually, or I don't cut them out, but I cut two of them. You get cut two of them. Yeah. You'll see. It's not here, Adam. It's not, I think it is there, actually. Something kind of odd about these is that there there is a finite amount of them in the game. Like, once I get this deposit, um, it will ne- Oh, there it is. There we go. Look at that. That got me, um, 80. Magic right It's- Oh, hey, Talon's playing Boss on X. Take a shot. <laughs> it's- Drink. Yep. Okay. So now that I bought a bunch of cores, I kind of want to go back and, uh- Oh. Oh, I forgot he needs to explain them. <laughs> it's- This game does have a lot of voice- Oh, he's back here. Did you see him teleport? They teleport, you know that, right? <laughs> Wanna see him run to the mountain and back? Wanna Wait. see me do it again? You don't even like Spang Boob. Spang Boob? Spang Boob. Spangle Bobble? Spangle Bobble. SpongeBob. You don't I, don't, even... I don't watch SpongeBob. You don't even like SpongeBob. Why'd you bring that up? Because what you just said was a reference to SpongeBob. What? That's a joke from SpongeBob. I heard that from a friend. Come on. It's Adam, it's from SpongeBob. I, I don't like. I don't, I'm not a fan of SpongeBob. PSI. Oh, now he's here now. Exactly. <laughs> that is in like parentheses. <laughs> yes. You gotta read between the lines. You know, the cards are all. I, I just noticed something that might be sort of a plot hole. Oh dear. The cards are all over the place, and it's implied that the kids um, are like gaining ranks as they do all as they like do their summer camp stuff here. However, only you're allowed down here, and this is the only thing that can exchange these cores. So, like, is everyone just collecting cards and then not doing anything with them? Probably. They may be <laughs> trading them. They all have the same thing on them. Or maybe you're just his favorite. <laughs> Favoritism. Yeah, so we got two free ranks because I collect. I've been collecting a lot of cards, and our next uh, power or our next ability will uh, be at level twenty. <laughs> <laughs> like, how physically near do you want? Because you're it, way right up there. down here. Oh, it turns out I can get this now. Oh, sweet! Yeah, there's a little that. platform. Oh, yeah, I have enough uh, side cards to make a side challenge marker. Let's jump back down and do this again. Oh dear, it's a whole level of things. This is how I play a lot of my games, by the way. Like, I'm very minute, I, I, I'm very attentive, or, I'm very minute when it comes to most attentive things. That doesn't make sense. <laughs> I micromanage a lot. It's like when you're playing the Pokemon go. Sun and you spent, like, so much time, like, trading teams. Yes, because I wanted the perfect team, such as Amolga. My team was pure and it beat yours. Ha. Hmm? My team beat yours. Well, I was using an Amolga. <laughs> Didn't you say you like using them strange Pokemon? Oh, there's a there's a scavenger hunt item. A gold doubloon. Yeah. I'm just going around and collecting a bunch of arrowheads right now. Did you cut any of it out? Yes. I just did like two. Oh, there we go. Oh, there's a there's a card. By the way, at this point, my editing style, whenever I do this, gets kind of sporadic. Um, I believe this is the part near the entrance of the lake. You guys figure it out on your own. There's yeah, no, no, yeah, this is near the lake. <laughs> it's... And this is, like, to the left side of the lake. You can apparently jump over here, and there's, like, a bunch of cards and stuff you can get. This is a fun overworld. Yeah. I like a lot of secret things being hidden in my overworld. This game has a lot of that. And then I noticed there's like an entire section of the level up here. So <laughs> it's... 
All right, time for an adventure. Yep. Oh, there, <laughs> there's another scavenger oh, on it's item. Oh, not comic. It's a comic. 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 Read any good comics recently? Uh. No. A uh, space battle lunchtime. Oh, have you guys ever read a comic called Ricky Rouse Has a Gun? Oh yeah, that. One. It's amazing. Also read Space Battle Lunchtime. It's literally about Chinese bootlegs. <laughs> That's what he says when there's really nothing in like, maybe like a 10 mile radius around you. I still managed to find some anyway. Look, I already have like 600 of these things. You can get them so fast if you know what you're doing. You gotta go fast. Oh, can you get past those jerks who were blocking you off? No, from the dock? no. Not for a while, actually. Rap Boy Genius and Blue Man Group. <laughs> Don't call them Blue Man Group. So the area that um, I think this is the the like um, the um, the isolation chamber place. There's like a random cave in that section, and it leads to the lake. And I I just went through it backwards. Huh. Again, there's a lot of stuff to explore. Also, I think the deposit is on the outside of the um, is on the outside of the cave. So I don't know what I'm wasting my time here for. <laughs> it's. You need to get fast feet. Hmm? There's a way to go faster. Raz has to go fast. <laughs> there we go. Can we just make an entire episode of Dank Families? Oh, 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 uh, these two are great. I'm hiding. And I thought, oh, Nils, when will you peek into the hole in my heart? Because you just see yourselves staring back. What? <laughs> I put the item away like, wait, what? Wait, what? Why is it so close now? Nils. He has a secret for him. <laughs> hey, not fair. This is so rude. His tinfoil hat is photorealistic. Hyperrealistic. Hyperrealistic. <laughs> if you want to be a creepypasta. Who's Nils? <laughs> What? Wait. It's girl. Why is there a random cutscene here now? Didn't you play this? Yeah. Actually, I see some people skip this cutscene because um, you can you don't actually have to leave Sasha's lab in order to do much of this. But the psychonauts are not what they used to be. Times have changed. The world just doesn't need us anymore. The world does too need psychonauts. <laughs> right here at this very camp, in fact. I think there are several fishy. Ooh, foreshadowing. Oh, look at that deep foreshadowing. <laughs> she has no nose. I just know she has no nose. It's like a red. It's just slightly red. <laughs> That's gonna bother me now. Bobby's pink hands and now Lily with no nose. <laughs> it's... Wait! <laughs> Dogen! I told you what I um I was watching Raukow play this. Some commenters were theorizing that um that Dogen was somehow Raukow. Because they're kinda <laughs> it's What are you doing? I'm to trying her? to set her on fire. Again, you can set every single person well you can't set them all on fire, but you can try to set them on fire. <laughs> it's How long are you gonna collect arrowheads Quite for? <laughs> I need, I need to. Move along, little doggy. Nothing to burn here. Careful, eh? My hair goes up in flames. And, <laughs> and the hairspray helps too. <laughs> oh my God! What? It's on going. You, <laughs> we need, we need arrowheads. Maybe not this many, but we do need them. You need to stop. <laughs> I think I do this like three times in the, in, in the game. I just go out and grind for- oh, hey. We're sorry. Oh, we're about to see something kind of secret. It's a psychic bear. Okay, so defeating the psychic bear can be kind of a challenge. Um, most people just set it on fire, which in terms of damage just kind of acts like a poison. The, the bear is kind of creepy. He can send like a psychic claw out at you to grab you in place and then come over and like, and like just try to charge at you. He's astral projecting. <laughs> he can also float. Oh, the poor boy. Why did you punch him? I don't know. I didn't think he was dead. 
You know, there's a way to get some intel on every single monster in this game. Um, apparently, the wildlife um, has been... Well, the, uh, the, the like, Citanium stuff underneath the camp has, has mutated some of the wildlife. So later in the game, there are, like, jaguars that, that also have psychic powers. Oh, dear. It's... You <laughs> fell off the rail. I fell. Time to go back. But first... Guys, um, like this video if you think he's taking up too much. <laughs> Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Oh, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> this is another card. What? It never ends. It never it? ends. There's a lot of stuff in this game. I warned you this was a collectathon. <laughs> yeah, but I didn't think you'd leave in every single goddamn item. I said it was a hundred percent run. Oh, you can also set this on fire. Good. Burn down the camp. <laughs> All right, let's try this again. Look at this cool boy. I actually go kind of slow this time. Okay, this. It's very easy to just fly right off of that. There we go, there's the condor Why'd egg. Why'd you take an egg? Huh? Because it's part of the scavenger what egg. What if that hatches in your pocket? You just got a gross So <laughs> what, the crow feather? Yeah. We're making friendship bracelets. You know, for our friends. Why is that in quotation marks? Is that my name on that one? Not unless your name is Frankie. But that's their names, right? Hey! Oh, are these these guys are jerks. <laughs> you know, all of this is very easy to skip. Like that one thing I always admire about this game is that there's a lot of stuff you can do in between that you may never see. <laughs> Picking up these terrible kids. Yeah. Again, you got you gotta see what it's I think, oh, now I gotta go buy the thing again. Oh, dear. What? Okay. Is this the end of the collectathon? Well, it's never really <laughs> no, the end of the No, it's not. We're maybe, like, like 10% of the way through the game. <laughs> uh. Uh. Oh, that's good. <laughs> that's creepy. I told you. All right, so let's go ahead and buy the cobweb duster. Fine. All right, you're gonna take that now and get through the mental cobwebs, right? But then I discover something. Oh dear. Oh, the rank. You don't. I'm not rank twenty. <laughs> well, let's buy some other stuff then. We just spent all that time. <laughs> hey, we're gonna need it later. So instead, I decide to buy. I think the magnet. What does the magnet do? It's basically draw from Kingdom Hearts. Oh, okay. And if you want to skip a bunch of ranks at once, well, you should talk to the camp ranger about his scavenger hunt contest. You mean him? <laughs> He's everyone. Mm hmm And everyone is him. <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it. So we get we get draw. Woo. And now I don't have enough for uh for the cobweb duster anymore, so I'm gonna do some more grinding later. Oh, what? I'm gonna leave all of it in. I'm gonna leave. Aaron, this this segment was like ten hours before. <laughs> it's before I did all that editing. He was waiting here that whole time. Yeah, you made him wait. <laughs> You broke him, you broke his mind and then you made him wait. I broke him. You broke Sasha. I broke Sasha. You broke Sasha. Good night, everyone. Marahana Kwanzaa. Marahana Kwanzaa.